so random in the building, you feel me, man? I hope you have a good day today and keep going no matter what. If you're tired, go to work today. Even like even if you are tired, don't don't sleep in. What's one thing that scares you about quitting your job? It's scary to quit your job, right? I think I'm gonna quit my job once I I'm gonna quit once I'm stable enough with my business. It's tempted to quit, I know. Don't worry about where you're heading right now if you're young, you know? But while we're young, we don't really know where we want to go yet. If you're in school right now, you probably know where you want to go. But if you're in high school, you really probably don't know where you want to go yet. But that's okay. If you quit too early, it might feel good right then and there. But later down the line, it's not going to feel so good. Having the equipment for the service is the hard part when you're a service person. For the products, the hard part about that is having a place to store your products and delivery, delivery fees, shipping. But as long as you're confident in what you're doing, service product wise, you'll figure out more and more what steps you need to take to present yourself more professionally. Organize your mindset, but organize your systems once you make those systems. How you keep your mind good for work. This is my way of keeping myself up and active. Have an unbreakable confidence in what you're doing, an unbreakable faith. No matter what the odds are, you're still faithful in that positive, even if it's slim. Be resilient. Be ready for all of it and do your best to not respond super angry. You know, sometimes people really do want to help, but they, but they don't know how to say it in a way that's helpful. So do your best to be understanding of people while you're making your way up in this world. Because what one may think is positive, the other may think is negative. So the ability of understanding is a skill that takes time. And the more complex the topic is, the harder it will be to understand. If you wanna quit, make a plan on how you could quit as soon as possible. That will be the end goal. How will you get to that end goal as fast as possible, but not hasty, yet still effective to your life? But sometimes it will be those times where you have to reach your steps by a lot. And it will feel like you're going backwards. But in reality, sometimes we really do need minor setbacks for major comebacks. It's like cutting your ends on your hair. Even though your hair is getting shorter in that moment, it's going to make a comeback to get longer. And it's healthy for your hair to cut your ends. It helps your hair grow way more smoother and you're not gonna have split ends. Keep in mind to make time in mind for people. Yep. If they really matter to you, you will make time. And if that product really matters to you, you will make time for it. Recap, turn zero dollars into 25 cents or more. That's the goal. Drop a comment if you really did it. I'm gonna do a video of me doing it. So yeah, you have a good day and have a good break, you know? Have a good night. Simple vlog guide, there we go. And this is a couple uploads I did right there. Shout out to my family. Hey. Oh, that? Oh. 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 O